Hello guys, welcome back to the Simple Snip Code. My name is Rahul, and in this video, we will install Android Studio in Ubuntu 22.04. Okay, so let's start the video. The first, the first way to install Android Studio is simple. Uh, open any uh, web browser and type Android Studio and and hit enter. After that, go to this site uh, developer.android.com and click on download Android Studio. You can see here the download Android Studio button is here. You can simply click here and download Android Studio here. But we cannot download uh, Android Studio from here. We can download Android Studio from Snap. Uh, the Snap is a package manager where you get all package. Okay. So first uh, we have to find Android Studio in Snap uh, package manager. So simple write Snap find and in the double quotes write android hyphen studio and hit enter okay you can see here uh, we can find android studio uh, android studio and the version is 2021.2.1 uh, okay and you can see here the in the uh, uh, in the android studio website the uh, latest version available is 2021.2.1 one okay and uh, this version we can also find in snap Nokia, snap package manager okay so simple uh, we install now an android studio so write sudo snap install or we have to install android studio so simple copy here and paste it here after that write hyphen hyphen uh, we have to install classic the so simple cop copy classic and paste it here okay this is the command sudo snap install android studio hyphen hyphen classic and hit enter write sudo password after that it will take some time to install android studio the installation is complete uh, the the android studio file is approx 1 gb it will take uh, half and half from my side uh, it's it's very from your side it depend upon your internet okay so click on show application and search android studio here right android you can see here android studio is now installed in our linux system okay so click on it and uh, here two option is coming a uh, config or installation directory and second one is do not import setting okay if you are before install android studio on your system then simply click on config or installation directory and select a folder uh, if you are a phrase user then simply do uh, click on do not import settings click on ok so click here and click on don't send and after that click on next uh, here, here also two uh, option is coming uh, the first one is standard and second one is custom so my recommended is uh, select standard and after that click on next and here two option your two themes are available first one is Dracula and second one is theme okay so here I select Dracula uh, you can also select light okay after installation you can change uh, theme okay so uh, right now I select Dracula and click on next and here uh, here is also uh, install some files the file space is 407 mb okay again it will take some time so i click on next click on accept and click on next click on finish okay uh, it will take some time to install all the uh, dependency or we can say components okay the downloading component is done click on finish after that click on android studio okay you can see here the uh, android studio is complete installation okay after that click on new project and here i select uh, empty uh, empty activity select next okay uh, you can change your uh, name of application but here i can uh, but here i am test application so i am not changing the applications application name okay and after that you can select your language like java or kotlin so here i select java okay after that uh, click on after that click on finish okay 
so here here is also downloading uh, like 63 mb files okay so here downloading after that it is unzipping the installation is done click on finish after that it will take some time if you are install android studio uh, in our system first time then it will take some time just like uh, it downloading gradle for our uh, project the file size is 115 mb after that it will take uh, one two or five one or more files downloading okay so here click on this minus symbol after we can see uh, the load uh, the project is loading now okay so it will take some time uh, approx 5 to 10 minutes it also depending upon your internet because it is downloading some files so you can see here uh, it will downloading gradles you can see here all the uh, dependency or component all will installed okay so simple click on activity underscore main dot xml file okay you can see here uh, there are there are three parts uh, the first one is code you can only see a code and the second one is split you can see your code as well as your output screen and third one is output screen okay so here i click on split okay and i uh, run my device okay so uh, sorry i run my code in my device so you can see here uh, right now don't have any device in my system okay so we have to install any uh, virtual uh, virtual emulator it's time to run our code uh, so we can see here currently i don't have any uh, devices okay i uh, i i don't connect any physical device as well as i don't install any uh, virtual device okay so i install virtual device okay. simply click on device manager or as well as you can click on tools or you can go to device manager okay after that click on uh, create virtual device and you can select uh, your code for tv phone vr os for tablet automotive okay so here i select phone okay after that click on next okay and after that you have to select any version like uh, pi oreo you got okay so here i select pi and click on download click on accept and click on next okay so again it will take some time uh, so you can see here the file size is the file size is 875 mb so okay so it will uh, i hope it will take 10 to 15 minutes to install after downloading uh, it will uh, unzipping the file okay so here it, you can see here uh, it will unzipping the file so you can see here it will done click on finish after that uh, click on pi and again click on next you can select your device according to landscape or portrait okay so here i select portrait you can change your avd uh, means your device name okay so here my device name is pixel 2 you can change okay but here i don't change any name leave it default and click on finish okay. after that close it uh, now you can see here uh, pixel 2 api 28 is available device okay simple select simple select this device and click on here run app and you can run your app in your virtual device